Whitley. My best friend, my one and only, my sunshine, my Wilson, my love. This is it. We're finally here. Take a second to breathe and take it all in. Brian, I've written and rewritten these words too many times. You know how I tend to overthink everything, but not when it comes to marrying you. Being your wife is the one thing in my life I have never second-guessed, because every part of me belongs to you. I didn't understand what people meant when they said the words, you make me a better person, until I met you. We are gathered here today to celebrate the uniting of two lives. Brian and Whitley have sought and found the will of God concerning marriage for their lives and have chosen this day to begin their life together. I find it crazy to think about how each and every person here has been living their own life day in, day out. We are all in our own paths. Each of us goes through life not knowing what is about to happen next. Along the way, we bump into other people and make friends. Some of these friends start as strangers and others are made from family. Some of these relationships last for years and then slowly fade away. Others last for a lifetime. Whitley, today in this moment, our paths collide together and become one. From here on out, we are on the same path as a team, taking life on one day at a time. I promise these vows I give you will remain constant. I promise I will be your best friend even when life flat out sucks. I vow to be the leader of our home. As a husband and as a father, I will strive to be a better man than I was yesterday. I promise to keep you second to God, but first to anyone else. I vow to always tell you the truth and to remain transparent and discuss everything with you, keeping nothing from you. Brian, I will spend the rest of my life trying to live out how much I love you because there's no way these words or any words will be able to say it. relationship pictures for us God's redemptive plan for all mankind through Jesus Christ. The love Brian and Whitley have for each other and the marriage relationship that will bind them together is the most perfect expression of the love of God. Well, for as much as Brian and Whitley have pledged their lives to each other by their vows and with the giving and the receiving of rings, I do by the authority granted to me by God pronounce them husband and wife in the name of the Father and the Son and the Holy Spirit. Brian, you may kiss your bride. Ladies and gentlemen, it is my pleasure to introduce to you for the very first time, Mr. and Mrs. Brian Ellsner. Today, we begin to make the memories that we will look back on when we're old and we're wondering where the time went. When you look back in life, I want to be in every memory that makes you smile. I know that I will look back on everything and see you in everything that I love. Let's do this.